Christians should not proactively pick fights with unbelievers. We don't need to call them names. We don't need to get into unnecessary arguments. We don't need to belittle them for their beliefs or their values. We should not be looking for a fight with the world. We should be looking for ways to win the world. When you look at the way Jesus engaged the world, people far from him, it isn't through picking fights, but proclaiming the faith and living out the implications of the kingdom of God. And so when it comes to believers, the message and the ministry of Christ, uh, the, the good news of the kingdom, how Jesus is in the process of making all things new, it does elicit opposition as we see here in this passage. But they don't go looking for trouble. See, Jesus did not fight the world with his fists, but with his heart. Jesus did not use his hands to hurt the world, but his hands to heal the world. Jesus did not protect his life from the world, but he gave up his life for the world. So Christians, hey, listen, let's not be stupid. Let's not go looking for opponents to fight, but opportunities to share and show. It's hard to win people when you're at war with them. 